name is Brianna Drake Ablak from St. Mary's Canada Catholic Church in Houston. I'm going to tell you a story about a young man taking a gift for granted. A young man was getting ready to graduate from college. For many months, he had admired a beautiful sports car in a dealer's showroom. And knowing his father could well afford it, he told him that was all he wanted. As his graduation day approached, the young man awaited signs that his father had purchased the car. Finally, on the morning of his graduation, his father called him into his private study. His father told him how proud he was to have such a fine son and told him how much he loved him. He handed his son a beautifully wrapped gift box. Curious and still disappointed, he opened the box and found a lovely leather-bound Bible with the young man's name embroidered in gold. Angry, he rose his voice to his father and said, with all your money, you give me a Bible and storm out of the house. Many years passed and the young man was very successful in business. He had a beautiful home and wonderful family, but he realized his father was very old and thought perhaps he should go to him. He had not seen him since that graduation day. Before he could make arrangements, he received a telegram telling him that his father had passed away and willed all of his possessions to his son. He needed to come home immediately and take care of things. When he arrived at his father's house, the son had a mix of emotions. He began to search through his father's important papers and saw the still gift-wrapped Bible, just as he had left it years ago. With tears, he opened the Bible and began to turn the pages. His father had carefully underlined a verse, Matthew chapter 7, verse 11. And if ye, being evil, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more shall your heavenly Father, which is in heaven, give to those who ask him? As he read those words, a car cue dropped from the back of the Bible. It had a tag with the dealer's name the very same dealer who had the sports car he had desired. On the tag was the date of his graduation and the words paid in full. How many times do we miss God's blessings because we cannot see past our own desires? Why do we take things for granted? This story reminds us that God has given us many gifts, including the gift of life. We should never take that for granted and instead use our life to help others and continue on the path of good. Thank you.